Sheena. Thank yes. you for joining us. Thank you for and having me. welcome to the country. Yes, I'm it's very excited. Time, so I believe. This is my first time in South Africa. Yes. Very excited. Oh, well, we're happy to have you here. So you're a Hollywood actress joining the cast of our local production, Lockdown. Yes. How did you hear about this production and why did you decide to get involved in it? Well, I found out about this production through a friend of mine and fellow business constituent, Bart Phillips, who has a company named Sunseeker. And so we we uh, did a show, uh, a show called Triumph, the Triumph Awards for three straight years. and. Um, he came over here and had some business dealings and he came back home to the States and said, Tashina, I think you have to be a part of this production. And I'm like, what production? What is it? Yeah. And uh, he told me it's a great show called Lockdown. And uh, it's by a guy with a company called uh, Black Brain Productions, Mandala. And I spoke with Mandala over the phone and I was just blown away about where he was coming from with it and his heartfelt, you know, passion into what he has put into the show Lockdown. On top of being able to work with my female counterparts all the way over here in South Africa is actually an honor. Mm -hmm. It's an honor to be able to be a part of an amazing all-female cast. And the, the name, you know, I forgot the name. Pamela Novette. Pamela Novette. Mm. I'm very excited about working with her. I watched a few episodes, yes. and these women are not playing. I mean, we've got some veterans that I'm about to work with, Absolutely. so I'm very excited, extremely. Yeah. Now tell us about your character. Um, she's Pauletta, right? Yes, my character's name is Pauletta. And I think I come in, you know, top of the third season. I heard that we were left with a, a cliffhanger. Yes. yes, there was a cliffhanger, yeah. Okay, so maybe give us a little, just so we get an idea of what it is you'll be doing and how long you'll be on there for. Okay, I don't know how long I'll be on there for. That depends upon how good I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> but I hope to be on for a very long time. Okay. But I'm here in South Africa shooting for two weeks. Mm -hmm. So uh, we'll see, hopefully, more to come. But uh, I love my storyline. Mm -hmm. uh, I come in with certain intentions, and I am doing certain things to get what I want, but not everybody knows it. Well, no one knows it. Mm -hmm. uh, and I'm using a certain... <laughs> I'm using a certain, uh, I'm trying not to give away the storyline. Uh, I'm coming in one way, but my intent is completely different. Oh, and I am playing different. American actor, well, an American woman, which kind of makes it a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Saves a lot of time on me learning the Zulu language. But <laughs> that I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get it. Cause I wanna play other roles in South Africa, but um, yeah, it's a uh, it's a very intriguing role. She's very um, she's very she has a lot of facets, mm -hmm. a lot of dynamics about herself that I guess you will soon to come know <laughs> as t as time passes and as we get yeah. towards the end of the season. I actually can't wait to see you in that role because I know you as Pam from uh -huh. Martin, <laughs> as on um, Everybody Hates Chris. Yes. And now, so we'll be seeing someone different from the comedic. Yes, yes. From your comedic side. So we'll be mm, seeing someone definitely. more serious. What I love, that's another reason why I, I took this role when I was asked to do it is because it allows me to play a dramatic role. Now, I have played dramatic roles before. I did a show, a, a movie called The Lena Baker Story, Hope and Redemption. It was about, it's a true story about the first black woman to be executed in the state of Georgia, who was post uh, pardoned after she was, uh, you know, killed in the electric chair. Um, so here I am once again with a great opportunity to play a role and play in a show that is a, a dramatic, you know, role and uh, a drama that I'm able to, you know, sink my teeth into a little bit because I like to spread my wings as an actress. Mm -hmm. And uh, this, this, this lockdown production will definitely be one of uh, uh, the great vehicles that I'm able to do so. Oh, okay. Now you've been, I'd say you're a Hollywood veteran. You've been in the industry for about 37 years, yeah. right? Did you say 
say 57. 37. Yeah, okay. No, I mean 17, oh, yes. <laughs> 17 years, girl. Yeah, girl. Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> yes, I've been, in, I've been in the industry quite some time. Yes. I've been in show business since I was 11. Mm -hmm. This is all I, I've done. I am now 49 come June 28th. You don't look it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't Thank look a day over 30. I'm holding on. I'm holding on. <laughs>